Brothers and sisters, over the past two years, while you've continued to do your job protecting the public, our profession, your rights, your pensions, your pay and benefits have been under nothing less than an all-out assault by some extreme politicians. Those who oppose us these days are saying it very clearly in the media. In fact, they've made coming after you and this union a core of their political platform. One of the leaders of the attacks on firefighters and paramedics this election is former Massachusetts Governor Mitt Romney. Doesn't matter if you're a Democrat, Republican, or Independent. Since Mitt Romney is running for president, you need to know exactly where he stands on issues important to you as firefighters. But rather than me going through his record, you deserve to hear what Governor Romney stands for directly from him in his own words. When it comes to firefighters and our jobs, Mitt Romney doesn't get it. He says we need more firemen, more policemen, more teachers. Did he not get the message of Wisconsin? He doesn't understand why safer grants are crucial to local safety and preparedness. Uh, the federal government doesn't pay for firefighters or, or policemen, uh, so obviously that's completely absurd. Romney would eliminate both SAFER and FIRE Act funding for first responders and equipment needed to protect our communities. But the idea of simply guaranteeing that the government will keep its fire, police, and teachers intact, uh, that is not an effective way to get the economy going. But SAFER grants prevent firefighter layoffs, bring emergency responders back to work, and help understaffed fire departments secure their neighborhoods. He doesn't respect the work of firefighters and paramedics. The taxpayers shouldn't have to have money taken out of their paychecks to pay people in government who are our servants who are making a lot more money than we are. That's not true. And he's trying to pit us against the citizens we serve. I like being able to fire people who provide services to me. What he's really saying is he's opposed to public sector collective bargaining. And I support question two in Governor Kasich's uh, effort to restrict collective bargaining in, in Ohio. Uh, in the ways he's described, so I fully support that. He stood against firefighters in Ohio and public employees in Wisconsin. Your great governor, what a hero he is. Scott Walker, thank you. Mitt opposes the Public Safety Employer Employee Cooperation Act, telling the Fraternal Order of Police, I would not support an expansion of collective bargaining rights for public employees. If elected, Romney would be the most anti-worker president firefighters have faced. If a right to work piece of legislation reached my desk at the federal level, I'd sign it. The Romney-Ryan platform calls for a national law to weaken workers' rights. Mitt Romney was against saving the auto industry. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what I said. My, my, the headline you read, which is said, let Detroit go bankrupt. The American auto recovery saved 1.4 million jobs, adding 13% to state and local revenues that paid for public safety. Mitt Romney opposed firefighter pensions. Here's what he wrote in his book, No Apology. When I ran for governor, for example, I paid a visit to the firefighters union to pitch for its support. Union leaders had endorsed Massachusetts's two prior Republican governors, so I imagined I could count on them as well. Finally, I got the big question from the union leadership. Romney chose not to support professional firefighter pension legislation, and the union did not endorse it. It was the last time he spoke to our Massachusetts brothers and sisters. I was a severely conservative Republican governor. Governor Romney wanted to replace the state's pension with a risky market-driven 401k. When that failed, he shorted the existing fund by $645 million. If you want to know where I stand, by the way, you don't have to just listen to my words. You can go to look at my record as governor. Once elected governor, Romney refused to meet with professional firefighters. It doesn't matter if you're a Democrat, a Republican, or an Independent. Mitt Romney's record makes clear where he stands on firefighter jobs, your rights, and your pensions. It's clear he'd be a disaster for your families, your profession, this union, and for public safety. Just pass this message along to a friend. Thanks so much.